In this video, I want to talk about whether or not you have enough bone. Now, through a video, it's impossible for me to tell you directly whether or not you have enough bone, but I can give you some general guidelines on terms of where you're at in the bone loss process. And then, of course, we have a very solid scientific way of telling you whether or not you have enough bone. Generally speaking, the longer you go without teeth, the less bone you have. But on the flip side of that, with the advances in our ability to place implants, we actually can place implants in less bone today than we needed many, many years ago. We can angle implants, we can add bone, we can do all kinds of cool procedures to allow people who traditionally maybe in the past weren't candidates for dental implants to have dental implants. But how do I know exactly if I have enough bone? Well, we have something called a 3D, 3D or three-dimensional bone scan where we can scan your jaw bones and on a 3D rendering, we can tell you exactly if you have enough bone, and more so than just if you have enough bone, we can identify all the essential landmarks in the face and the jaw bones to ensure we're placing dental implants. We can do it with the highest level of precision to make sure it's the safest with, uh, procedure possible with the best outcomes. So in this video, I explain more about you know, bone loss and how do you know if you have enough bone or not to, in order to have dental implants.